Good morning, everyone. This is my first breakfast in England. I had continental breakfast at Hotel's Cafe. It's a buffet style meal. The waiter brings hot drinks. Of course, I ordered tea. There are some fruits, cheese, ham, bacon, yogurt, cereal, and some small breads. I picked yogurt with some dried fruits, cheese, ham, croissant, and sweet breads. I usually don't eat lots of food for breakfast, but this day I'm going to visit many sightseeing spots. I need more power. I should eat a lot now. I'm not sure what time could I have lunch today. My stomach was almost full. But waitress asked me, How about bread? I said, I ate croissant. She said, Don't worry, it's included in that breakfast. We have white, brown, and one more another different kind of bread. I forgot what kind of bread was another bread. I was full, but I ordered brown bread. I've heard from British friends that British bread and butter are the best in the world. That's why I wanted to eat them. After a while, the freshly baked bread came to me. It's a sliced toast of six triangles. The bread was really good. That crispy texture was great. I'd like to eat various kinds of British bread at bakery next time. Okay, my energy is full. Let's go for sightseeing. My staying hotel was near Tower Hill Station of Underground. Tower Hill Station is near Tower of London. Do you know that? People in London, when they take a bus and tube, they use Oyster card. If you charge money for that card, you can get on that tube and bus cheaper than normal rates. I already had that card from my English school's friend, so I took the tube like a Londoner. I'm the master of the circle line now. I heard that the London subway is the oldest in the world. But there is no garbage. It's clean bones. In the station. In the train. Mind the gap. This station is Charing Cross. How many times did I listen this announce? Anyway, I decided to go sightseeing in order go guidebooks. The first place was Trafalgar Square. Wow! How many times did I see these views from Japanese TV news and magazines? I tried to go around the fountain. British morning is cloudy and chilly in the summer. I asked the person I saw at the hotel elevator this morning. It's cloudy and cold today from in the morning. It will be rain. The lady said, 
<laughs> It always looks like this in the morning of London. The National Gallery is in Trafalgar Square. There is a free National Art Museum. There are 2,300 paintings of famous painters such as Monet. I was completely satisfied with the art there. But I made a big mistake. I didn't go to the British Museum. I thought that the British Museum was a uh, only painting museum. I didn't know there are various exhibits in the British Museum. Here is the souvenir shop of the National Gallery. I bought here some stationeries, double-decker printed tote bag, and Union Jack flag. They are so cute! Stickers were running on the road. They looked so British. The sun from noon was strong and hot, but people were laying and relaxing there. I also ate ice cream. Beautiful flowers healed my tiredness. Finally, I came to Buckingham Palace in Britain's largest palace. Of course, Queen lives here. Beautiful and impressive.
him. What I felt when I came to this country, people are polite and answered my questions properly. In Japan, only bad news from foreign countries are widely reported on TV news. I thought maybe British people do not prize themselves so much. That part looks a little like a Japanese. <laughs> Anyway, I was so moved by coming to this country. The temperature getting high. I went back to the hotel. I changed the t-shirts. And let's go round two.